Uh, book them for the 8th. Oh, no, the 7th. Of August? It's the dry period. No, not the month, the 8th circle. 7th. 7th circle. I keep saying we should switch to a day calendar. The system you have is... And tell him the next time he comes alley-catting around, yowling for a higher percentage, that I will personally... Well, not personally, but I will, you know, direct someone to personally rip his intestines out. Mm -hmm. And then I'll... And this part I'll do. I'll, I'll knit them into something. Um, something like, uh... What do you not want your intestines knit into? A necktie. Um, like a, a throw blanket. Like an ugly throw blanket. Okay, well, not that, but... Something like that. Hi! We, uh, we found people to, uh, to play tonight. Really? Yeah. Really? Uh, Black House? Uh. Yo, yo, yo! It's Black House in the house! Okay. Oh, Lord, not again. Thanks for the encore! Yo, yo! We won't let you diggity diggity down. Oh, come on. They'll be fine. They had their practice runs, and now they're ready for the big show. Right, guys? Yo, yo, yo! It's the same guys from before, yeah, in case you, you don't have notice. to answer that. They're ready. We're ready. Yeah, I don't know about this. Maybe with some uh, taxi dancers. I mean, this, it, it needs some elasticity to it. Taxi dancers. dancers? This isn't Studio 54. I wish it was Studio 54. If you can't sing, Valak, you dance. If you can't dance, you set things on fire. That's the rule of rock and roll. And no one is going to watch obscenity peddlers rap like their brains are on strike unless things are humping each other in the background while they do it. <laughs> Milo and Lola, want to stand in for me? Uh, yeah. Oh. And we're taking a drink. Seriously? Awesome. Just Shadow Valak. He'll show you what to do. What? I just need to see it in a group, you know? Of course, you couldn't have asked me to do this when I was still jogging. Valak here has been wanting to dance on the Buddy Dean show since he was in Pigtails. He choreographs most of the numbers that come through here. Buddy Dean couldn't handle me, honey. You two, it'll be easy. Just follow the moves as I go along. Liquid Courage was perfect for this. Deviate. Hey, all right. I've been looking for an perfect. excuse to show off my, uh, my moves, you know? Yes, your moves. It'll be all right, Milo. Just like the, the, the talent show we talked about. You in sixth grade? Oh, you mean the one you couldn't even say anything about because you were so embarrassed by the memory of it. Wait, 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 wait! Don't start the show without me! I always love live dancing. Are you guys gonna show Bush, or is it just tits up? <laughs> oh my god, will you fuck off, Wormhorn? We don't need this shit right now. <laughs> Are you sure you want to do this? Lola's right! I mean, Milo, do you really remember the sixth grade talent show? That didn't turn out so well, did it? <laughs> I mean, let's be honest. Lil Chad Leckler beat you up so bad you had to take off school. Wait, Milo, you said you got the flu. Honestly, he was throwing up so much, it's not that big of a lie. Well, Lola's gonna dance her fucking face off up here, so who cares what happened to me when I was a kid? Wait, don't listen to it, Milo, it's not... It's simple. Just move like I move. Whatever, guys, come on. My bones are falling asleep here. I don't know Let's what that means! this show on the freeway. Play the music. Okay, up, down, left, and right, gotcha. Yo, 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 yo. Turn it up. Turn it up, yeah. yeah turn up the bass a little. Yeah. What? Oh, God. Oh, I hit the wrong buttons. That's your shit. Yeah. yeah, turn up. Turn it down, actually. Turn, turn down the bass a little. What? What do you mean you suck? Okay, here. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Oh, it's fun. Bad. It's more fun for me. There we go. Yeah. Into the groove here. Okay, whatever. This is nuts. Give me a little, a little lick here. Give me a little lick. You're doing well, but you're like, just not. Turn up the vocals a little bit. Turn, turn up the vocals. Is that right? Is right? Ugh, this okay. game is nuts. I found my place. Oh no. Okay, yeah, there we go. I'm not gonna be good at this. I hear myself. I, okay, yeah, that's that's good. Yeah. Oh. Wait, wait, yo, yo, I got the first place. My meter is all the way to the left. Okay, you got the first verse. Don't be good, be bad. Don't be good, be bad. 
Oh, I didn't even... There it I didn't see it. You're worse than I thought you'd be. It went down to three again. Oh, my God. My name is... Oh, the track's old. <laughs> we did it. Yeah. Oof. I did good! I knew I should have stopped playing basketball at the Y. Very nice. I can... I can see it. I really can. With professionals, it'll really distract from the horrifying music. Yo, yo, yo! Thank you, dog! She wasn't talking about you. Oh, well, Miss Ona, what... what did you think? Uh, is that good or bad? Better than I expected. Uh, what? That's it? They suck! Screw you! Oh, God. Whatever. Now that that bit of unpleasantness is in our rear view... I'll let you unfurl the banners. Tell Linda she's free for the evening. There right. we go. Awesome. Thank you. Valak will riddle out the details. I imagine you'll be going to Morning Stars now. Uh, Satan's, yeah. Ah, uh, yes, to try to outdrink him, get back home. Do you think you'll be able to do it? The two of you. Even if I had uh, misgivings, we have to try. It's the only way out we've heard of uh, so far. Lucifer was the first rock star. You know, before Liz, before Paganini, before that caveman that played a dinosaur's rib cage like the xylophone. It was him. And notoriety makes you forget things. Responsibilities to yourself and others. And look, he has bigger things to worry about tonight than a drinking contest. Like what? Responsibilities like what? It's just, every human creature carries microscopic mites. Mites that live full, hectic, provocative lives. They fall in love, have children, die tragically. And I say this not to make you itch. I say this so that when you see rock stars and movie stars and people with jets, when you meet Satan, remember that you are all planets responsible for a billion souls. God. And so is he. And what else could be more important than that? Say hi to Linda for me. We'll be in touch. Thanks for uh, being the uh, the lead back there. I just, you know, I really should just stay in my lane. You can do this stuff, Milo, all right? The sixth grade was a long time ago. You're cooler than you were, no matter what that librarian told you. <laughs> well, let's give Linda the good news and get her damn invite. All right, so mites and bacteria and whatnot have souls, apparently, we've learned, which is weird. All right, so I'm going to grab another drink just in case because mine is empty. Boy, did I look out on that, right? I had one drink left for that final that final option, and uh, that was it. The music. All right, so what are we doing? Are we going to... Let's follow this up with a lovable Lush. A Jeffrey Bomber, if you please. Wait, what did she call it? What was it? A Jeffrey Bomber? Oh, my God. Yeah. Let's do it. Hello, Linda. Well, if it isn't my favorite fans again. Vickers blowing up about the reunion. Apparently, they all just arrived. It's funny. I was thinking maybe there'd be a chance Hedgy Jane Myers would end up, you know, north. She was running some fucking Save the Giraffes PSA campaign last I saw. Anyways, how'd the search for a last minute understudy go? It went great! Seeing as how this is hell, it probably didn't go so well. I really just have one question. Are you ready to fucking party with Mercury Worm tonight? You didn't. We did. We found you a replacement act. They're rappers. Just don't ask. <laughs> huh. I'm surprised. And it's hard to surprise someone who gets leeches put in her coffee every morning. Come on, walk me to the cap stand. I have to say, I thought this was going to be like baking cookies. You plan on making these perfect little Christmas trees and they come out looking like somebody's father issues. <laughs> but you guys really pulled it off. That's so true. And, uh, I'm a little embarrassed to say my elbows are sweating at the thought of meeting my old bandmates. Those bastards have gone on so long without me. I'm not sure they'll remember this damned old woman. Hey, Linda, you were the real star. No one comes to shows to see the bass player. They come to see the shorter than you thought lead singer who obviously hates her parents. I don't care about that. They can have the damn spotlight. We're dead. Nothing matters. 
It's just, we were like best friends, you know? Mm. And they did kind of screw me over, but I kind of screwed them too. By uh, hogging the attention? Yeah, well, that, and by embezzling album profits. But be oh. that as it may, I just hope we can remember why we became friends in the first place. Okay, I can work with that. Gotcha. So we don't, we don't necessarily want to see them fall flat on their face. Um, she just left without us? Dude, all right, let's talk. Hey, what is it? What's it actually like being famous and playing music to huge crowds? What do you think getting courted by supermodels and having throngs of thousands in your words back to you feels like? Um, pretty good? Wrong! I took a hollowed out rhinoceros horn of coke every morning just to face my butler. <laughs> getting validated from forces outside your control leads to beating up a bouncy castle because it looked at you funny. Seek acceptance from within, my friend. And if you can't, please buy my newest EP out tomorrow. It'll, it'll do the trick too, I promise. They're still selling shit down in uh, hell. All right, let's get out of here. Uh, Okay, so she's just out here waiting for us. That's kind of weird. Can we go this way first? I want to see what's over here. Also, I don't have my drink. The last time I saw Bobby Francis, we got in a fight over what to name our tour van stuffed monkey mascot. I told him. His name is Rico, or I'll see you in hell. <laughs> you think he'll remember? Milo, Bobby couldn't remember his daughter's name while we were on tour. No, <laughs> he will not remember. Ouch. All right, let's Friendships go. Friendships that long are like a marriage. Sometimes you just want to boil a person's face off and shoot the EMTs as they come, but well, dying alone is just too scary to even entertain the alternative. Um, we're not going to go too edgy. Well, we can't remember dying, so I guess I'll take your word for it. Whether you remember isn't the important part. You're not dead until there's nobody left that remembers you. That's why everybody wants to be famous. I think that's a famous quote. You die twice, once when you die, and once when everybody forgets oh, you. Oh, Milo wanted to be famous. No, I didn't. Why would you say that? Uh, you know what? I don't know. Just popped into my head. Ah, uh, don't worry about it. There's a demonic saying. The longer in hell, the more you are you are. It means... Eh, who gives a fuck what it means? Let's just get out of here. I want to go in there. Wait. Are there two demons there? I think I just saw Linda land in a Mercury Worm with two nerds. She looks worse than expected. Wash your face. <laughs> what do you mean, two nerds? I think there's a bug here. There's two guards, like, standing on top of each other. Unless that's intentional. It could be one's got a green face and one's got a pink face. I don't know. Why do they gotta call us nerds? They don't know me. Whatever. Yeah, you guys ignore us. Oh, what was that? Didn't it didn't I have that little shake before earlier? Damn, she almost fell into sticks. This is still the sticks, right? I want to go in these places. The sealed knot. I don't know if that's a reference or something. No idea. Very quiet. Like that. What is that? What is that? I want to go up there and look. What is that? Really shiny. can't walk up there. Why is it so quiet, too? Should we talk to each other? Anything? Anybody? No? It's a long silence. I f it feels awkward. I'm wondering if I'm missing something. What are the controls? Options. Pause. Talk. Drink. I think that's the the option system. Yeah, there's the drink. The shift. Yeah, um... I guess this is just... It's meant to be long silence. I need to be able to run. They're too slow. Ooh. 
What is that? Also, by the way, I wonder. Hey, uh, thanks a lot for this. Uh, just give the door gal my name. See you in there. Rock and roll. Uh, uh are we not coming with you? Awesome. We, we are awesome. awesome. Yeah. Okay, so we should just go to Satan's then, right? Like, hey, what's up? Let's just, uh, let's drink you down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. okay, yeah, let's just, uh, like a band-aid. Quick and easy, right off. Right off. I feel like, all right, hold on. I feel like, I wonder, so we, we completed this and we, we got the, the invite. What if something goes wrong? What if Linda gets there, sees like an old friend and then takes that person instead, right? Should I also do this? Should we also do this? And like a backup plan, I think we should. So I think we'll, if, if we have the option to, I'll do that. Um, taxi. Wait, before you go, it's time for your review. Oh God. What? Psychological assessment or Bumblefeed personality quiz. You know, whatever you want to call it. Bumblefeed. First of all, you intentionally chose to be a drink mule for somebody named Linda, of all things, instead of aiding that poor little demon who needed help apprehending a dangerous homo sapien. Either you thought this sounded more fun or Lola likes just blindly following my way around. Which, either way, I mean, getting a vodka soda for someone does sound simpler. Hey, bug nut, the plan worked. We're, we're going to Satan's party. Yeah. All right, all right, all right. So you needed to find a band to fill Linda's slot. Uh -huh. Which saps did you enlist? Oh, wait, I was there, so I already know. It was Black House. <laughs> Why the fuck did you pick these guys? The you know, ones instant there. Ono sobers up, she's going to realize you traded three-day-old coffee for curdled rat milk. <laughs> I mean, have you heard their songs? Or is rubbing muskrats on your junk something that interests you? Hey, Ono made the deal herself, yep. okay? Yep. I'm not gonna feel sorry that we swindled the, the demon that invented swindling or whatever. <laughs> uh, I guess we'll see if you can maintain your apathy when she circles the wagon back for a renegotiation. Okay, factoid time. Thought you might want to know what's going on in the land of the living. So while you were busy accomplishing this very important mission, instead of, you know, getting your ass off the fucking couch and contributing to society in any sort of meaningful way, Susan Lucille Charlesworth was born in Baker City, Oregon. Due to a host of psychological impairments, she will eventually burn her brother's house down, killing his family of four, and get away with it too. Oh. What? Jesus. 3,856 people died. In their entire lives, only 47 non-consecutive hours of true happiness was felt in my mem. Oh, God. So sad. <laughs> Wormhorn. And, of course... Oh, uh, sad. Wait, sorry, those are out of order. Wormhorn. <laughs> Lola won that dancing thing on her first try, you giant-ass dork. Who the hell is good at this stupid shit? Get a life. Whatever, you suck. Get us out of here, Wormhorn. We need to get on with our night before we're stuck here forever. So... <sighs> Fine. Whatever. I'll text you. I'll talk to you later. Okay. She's there to torture us. Anyways, right? So we kind of expect that. Taxi! Why do we have to call a taxi again? Hello? Hey, someone order a ferry? Yep. Had to go with Miss Landon. We rocked uh, it. Fine. Yes. We got the invite, so... Yay. What a long face. Personal demon dragging you down. <laughs> Listen, just remember, those things are like car sickness. Just keep your eyes on the horizon. It'll go away on its own. And sometimes you just need to deal with it to get to the mall, you know? Anyways, did you get the invitation? Yep. We did, actually. Get the fuck out of here. A whole VIP cut the entire line invitation for an already free drink? What did she really want? We had to uh, find a band to play her time slot. What band? Oh. Don't even worry about it. It wasn't two deranged rappers, was it? You're psychic. You're psychic. It's all over, Bicker. Oh, cool. Anyways, I imagine you'll be wanting to go to Satan's now, right? Finish the game. I, I mean, whatever. Breaking that fourth wall again. Uh, I can't go over here. So the game has already made one mention of a second playthrough. And the fact that I had an either or choice like this 
makes me feel like they totally want you to play a second playthrough. And I'm guessing we'll find out why soon enough. All right, let's uh, let's go here. I'm ready to party. Out drink Satan. Welcome way. All right, your request is my uh, my my thing that you do when requested them something. What command? Every man will have his favorite day, but few will know about them. This will... This should be one of your favorite days, I think. A uh, camel hair better, at least, than Bottomless Fries Friday. A VIP invitation to Sane's house party, that's, uh... You guys are doing... You're doing well. You're doing good. Goddamn straight! I don't have any poppers or noisemakers, so hopefully the ride, in my genuine amazement, will suffice. Day, I mean... We couldn't have done it without your help, Sam. You were the steed to our to our gallant knights. Oh God. Yeah, and a uh, word of advice if you make it back topside, maybe don't talk like that at your first job interviews. Oh yeah, when we get back, we'll be like adults. Oh, a little nervous about rolling over from Miss and Mister to Ma'am and Sir, and uh, depending on your income level, either having to read train schedules or caring about the estate tax. No, it's it's not. It's not leaving school so much as Milo and I have known each other forever. Yeah, like genuinely forever. We got paired up in preschool because we were the last pick in a buddy system. <laughs> and while Milo stayed in town to help his mom in her magic shop. Lola's moving across the country to live with her dad. Sounds like you guys are just erupting with excitement over all the new opportunities afforded by your continued cellular reproduction. Uh, yeah, definitely. Yes, Absolutely. Definitely. Absolutely. Without a doubt. <laughs> so, completely switching topics. Satan's party, huh? Very exciting. Top shelf. I'm ready. Roman Coliseum, Yang Zoo on opium. Mother, don't look at these pictures and stuff. Put away the Ouija boards and voodoo dolls, kids. Because anyone that'll be answering is too busy getting their nipples twisted. <laughs> How about another dollop of helpful advice? This time actually solicited. Milo, Christ, you don't need advice for how to party. You sound like Sun Sirdosh. Oh, but if I can't see, will anyone talk to me? Just use your hands and feel around until you get the vodka. Thanks, that's, uh, helpful. Happy to be of service. But, you know, advice is definitely welcome. We we are about to try to outdrink Satan. All right, candleflies. Have fun. You know, enjoy yourselves. Thanks. And, uh, before you scamper off, two things, okay? One. Sam, sorry. Are you, are you on tonight? Are you? Where are you headed? Sixth circle. Lucifer didn't show up for the inspection last week. And now I gotta make sure the stone coffins are being heated properly. Like, I don't have enough poop to worry about. Yeah, seems like it's a death style now. Wait, Satan didn't show up for work? Wideganger, sweat cooker of infidels, this is Milo and Lola, recently deceased. Yeah, congratulations. I'm foreman down to coffin mines in the city of Diz. And no, he didn't. Even though we had the appointment at 11, so we could sleep in. <laughs> Anyways, can you help me out? I know it's out of the way. No, I'll give you a ride. Great, thanks. I'd swim, but the lava starts hurting if you're in it for too long. Wait, Sam, what were your two things, uh, two pieces of advice? Was I gonna give you two? That seemed excessive. How about one? I'll give you one. Do you want to hear the first thing I was gonna say, or the second thing? Oh, no! Ah, uh, sorry. We just ran out of time for both. Is this washing bear. Uh, the second? Don't be intimidated by Morningstar. He's Satan. He's tall. He's had kings and queens commit atrocities in his name. And you can thank him for the Hurricanes winning the Stanley Cup in 06. <laughs> but at the end of the day, he's still just a boy. With worries. Um, okay. Text me if you need a ride somewhere. All right, don't get intimidated by Satan. Easy peasy. Uh, what do you think Sam meant by that? He's just a boy with worries. That was a weird thing to say, right? Like, he's probably not just a boy with worries. She's just saying he's probably, like, insecure about something, you know? Like, mm -hmm. like everyone has something they're worried about, and it doesn't matter how rich or powerful they are. Oh, like that guy in a nice suit I saw crying on the street after he dropped his taco. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sure he has his problems. Wanna skip the hustle and bustle and head straight to Lucifer's? Um, why is there an option to take the long way? I'm doing this out we'll of curiosity. One level at a time. Hey, I'm on your time. Watch your 
Your knees, there. Okay. All in. Why does this exist? Do I get more dialogue options? Is that is that what it's going to give me? Maybe it'll give me some more hints for the upcoming showdown? We'll see. Or is it going to be silent all the way there? Sounds silent. Sounds very silent. All right, we'll skip it then. If we get the option to. Two up. Doors closing. Oh, wait, do I? Oh, oh, God. I thought he was going to give me the option to, to, uh... To skip it, but no. Oh, boy. All right, let's get the show on the road, guy. We have a long way to go. I don't know why... I don't know why this is an option. Watch your shit. Don't drop it through the cage. I'm not diving down to get it. Wow. Is this a common thing? Does he have to deal with people shitting in the cage all the time? It's kind of weird. I thought maybe by taking the long way we would be able to have more dialogue, maybe get some hints hey, about eight. the drinking, Going up to the top. talk to some of the people in line. Alright, we're ready. Why are we zoom so far out? Oh, there we go. See us, suckers! Linda sent us. Invitations, please? Certainly. I think you'll find our names in Will Call. My name is Milo. I'm with Linda Landon, the famous acid jazz instrumentalist and musical transformationalist. Maybe you've... Next. And I'm uh, Lola. We're both with the uh, musical transformationalist. Okay, move along. There's party favors in back, but don't open his fridge. We did, we did it. it. I guess all that's left is for us to... Uh, Enter the party. Yes, entering the Lord of Darkness's party is what we are here to do and what we will do. I'm a little nervous. Yeah, it'll be, it'll be fine. We'll be fine. We're here for a thing and we're going to do the thing. Let's do it. Yes, exactly. And we'll be fine. So, how for you? Oh, we'll just pass through the... Oh my. We'll just <laughs> pass through the demon. 